Hey guys, what's up? It's Sky, and this video, this is videos going up kind of late, but we got our PewDiePie flavored G Fuel in cans. So let's get right into it. So I don't think I did a review on PewDiePie's powder. I don't remember, and I don't want to check right now. Hmm. But in terms of that flavor, it's supposed to be lingonberry. Um, and it's not my favorite. I mean, it's good, but, and I do tend to like the fruit flavors more than the other flavors. Um, but it's not like, like I would say in terms of, I might, I probably wouldn't buy another tub of it, but I still like to try all the things. So we're going to go ahead and try this and little tip they taste a thousand times better when they're chilled or cold or whatever but most sodas taste better most things most drinks taste better except for like coffee and tea depend depending on what you like so it doesn't the cans really don't have much of a scent by the way here's the image of PewDiePie. So, and I like how he literally called his flavor PewDiePie. <laughs> but let's go, let's try it. Hmm. So, I think lingonberries are closely related to cranberries? I think I should have looked this up because I because I knew at one point but then I forgot um but in terms of all the canned flavors that I've tried and I haven't done reviews for the first four cans I've done everything since um Faceberry Blue Ice, Ramble Sherbet, and Sour Cherry but I didn't think the first four groupings the ones I just said were that good and this one is kind of kind of hits me like one of those um kind of like a slap in the face of I don't know how I feel about this um I don't know because I I I immediately loved tropical rain cuz is my favorite powder flavor so I I was a little nervous because the cans don't really taste that closely to um the powdered they don't I don't know why um I don't know if it's a combination or a different kind of process to make but hmm. Hmm. I don't know I say it It does taste like a fruit. Um, I don't know. I don't think it's bad. It's just it's just such a slap in the face. Of I don't even know. Hmm. I'm just showing it again again. Um, hmm. definitely not one of my favorites so far. Maybe it'll grow on me. I don't know. Hmm. Well, I should have had, um, try, I should have had the powder version so I could have compared it like early in the day. So I'd have it fresh in my mind, but I haven't had it in a minute. Um, it's right here, actually. I am going to have to, uh, have this maybe, maybe tomorrow, and I'll compare it. Like, not make a video, but just for me to see. Um, but it is, it does pretty much taste how I would expect, even though I, I never know what to expect, if that makes sense. Um, 
it's not bad. I think it'll grow on me. Um, but I would, I would say though, if you like think the powder is great and you like the cans in general, definitely give this one a try. Especially if you like the powder, because I feel like if you like the powder, like if it's like your favorite, I'm going to burp, I think, but <laughs> excuse me. Um, I don't know. Cause for me, like I said, Tropical Rain, my favorite, and I really love the cans. Um, excuse me, carbonation. Um, I don't know. I don't really watch other reviews, other flavor reviews and G Fruit products on here, on YouTube. So I never really know, and I never know if somebody's being honest. But I, I pretty much am as honest as you're probably going to get. Um, that's probably, that's actually probably not true, but I'm not going to sugarcoat something just because I really like cheap fuel. Um, <laughs> but I would say if you really like the PewDiePie powder, you could, and you like the cans, definitely give this a try. You buy a four pack if you want. Um, they're, they're only like maybe $15 with shipping. I don't know how much the shipping is, um, for a four pack, but they're like ten ninety nine or something for a four pack. And if they still have... The tubs and the cans, they might have be doing the deal. Um, I actually don't know if these are for sale for sale. I got the early access for um, this. But they should be doing where you buy a tub, you get a free four-pack of cans, possibly. I think that's an option. Um, if they're both in stock. So I don't know. Um, but yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty much it. Yesterday, they announced uh, Butter's Starfruit Flavor. Um, which will be, I think, like, the 15th of July is release date, but I'll probably be ordering it sooner than then. Um, I don't know when the release date for the Sonic Peach Ring stuff is, but I think the Starfruit and the Peach Ring stuff, I think those are the only new things coming out soon. But kudos to GFU for putting out so much stuff so I can make these videos, even though, you know, not very many people watch them. <laughs> Um, but yeah, uh, that is my review of G Fuel's PewDiePie cans. So, I will catch you guys in the next video. Subscribe for more G Fuel reviews, G Fuel related videos. Thumbs up if you love G Fuel and if you enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.